Well, good morning, guys. Today's your last day at the Cow Emporium. Uh, we decided to keep these um, Cornish Giants in the barn this year. Now they've had fresh air, sunshine from, well, when it's not smoky out. And uh, they've got, they've got it pretty good in here. We've kept their bedding fresh to try and keep their bellies from getting too dirty. So we have a local hutterite colony that's gonna be butchering for us this time. We butchered over 50 of these guys last year and put them in the freezer. But we kind of want to do something different with our time this year. And it's uh, it's been really, really hot here. So I kind of don't feel comfortable butchering them when the temperature is so hot. So we're going to load them up in the stop trailer at supper time tonight and take them to drop them off. Only chicken left in there, Glenn. Yeah, just huh. Okay, well, I couldn't film because that was too much, but they're all in the stock trailer. And I know they're probably a little stressed, but they're together, so that's less stressful for them. Okay, so that was hot and sweaty. We have, I don't know, I'm using my phone so I can't tell the time because <laughs> who wears a watch anymore? Uh, we have about half an hour before we gotta head out with them. So I'm gonna go grab a drink of water and uh, my sunglasses. <sighs> you look like you've been welding. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Felt like you've been welding. I don't know, I might not be able to move my legs tomorrow after squatting that long. But anyway. So guys, and just like that, the chickens came home and they're safe and sound in the freezer. And uh, yeah, no, they don't look like they did before. And you know what? I would do this again. I know it makes them a little bit more expensive, but we're still saving money because we grew them ourselves. Our 24 birds ended up being uh, 115 pounds, which is not bad. All right, everybody, that's it for this video on the chickens. Have a great day. See you next time.